Hello, hello, hello everybody. My name is Greed, and welcome back to Up at Night, Pokemon Yellow. So last episode, we made our way through Rock Tunnel, and uh, yeah, we encountered some some not so pleasant Pokemon in there. Uh, but we're to pass that. We head to Lavender Town, explored it just a little bit. We're not going to do much in Lavender Town, actually. We're just going to go on and head on through to the next route. Because uh, why not? You know what? Let's, let's start off with a battle. What's a cute, round, and fluffy Pokemon? Um, Jigglypuff? I don't know if Jigglypuff has fur, but... Oh, yeah, Clefairy has some fur. That makes sense. That makes sense indeed. Go ahead and destroy this Clefairy mongrel. Okay, I did nothing. It's all right. Clean her up real quick. So for today's today's video, I think we're just gonna head on through this route over to Celadon City, and uh, there's a few things we actually need to do there um, that I'm actually very excited about. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and grind up on some of these trainers. I didn't do any off-screen grinding this time. I felt like we were adequately leveled for this stage of the game, so um, maybe I will after this episode, who knows. But for right now, uh, let's just battle some trainers, why not? I didn't do any grinding, so just get a, just hop right into it, you know what I'm saying? That's a dope sprite, I'm not gonna lie. Gambler. Aw, oh, Growlithe. I, I honestly was considering a Growlithe for my team, but uh... I ended up deciding against it because I feel like everybody uses a Growlithe. Oh, now I'm higher level, buddy. Can't do that. You can't do that. I'm just gonna crit you every single day. And a Vulpix. Oh, that's such a cute sprite. It's like bounding. Quick attack. Doesn't hurt. We're gonna go ahead and two shot you. Dude, Mongrel literally just crits every single hit. It's insane. Does Karate Chop have a high crit ratio? It feels like it. It definitely feels like it, I'll tell you that much. Missed the big score. Yeah, you sure did, bud. You sure did. Uh, I don't want to really go up there. Let's go ahead and just cut through. Who has it? Oh, my Charmander does. Hacked it down with cut. Avoid the grass, because why not? Oh, Sayonara. Head on over here. Shut up, this guy. Yeah, why not? Why not? Let's battle this guy, this gambler. Get again, six bright. Poliwag! Oh my god. I was also considering a Poliwag for my team. Such a cute Pokemon. Like, just look at it! Oh, I almost one-shot it, dude. What am I just gonna do? A good amount, actually. Did not ex expect it to do that much, to be honest. And another Poliwag. Surely we one-shot this one, right? Oh, Not even close. No! Oh. Thank god. I thought we were gonna get hacked out again. I was so not ready for it. Dude, the sleep is broken in this gen. Oh dear. <laughs> I thought that was his last Pokemon. It's so chalked, man. Don't do it! Okay. At least it was water gun. At least it was water gun. We don't have to deal with hypnosis shenanigans. I'll take it. Mama, we level 28. And we defeated the gambler. And. 28 to special level because that's right mongrel is evolving awesome dude mongrel evolved into primate and it's trying to learn rage um do i get that um I think I like my, my moves, honestly. I don't think I really need it. But yeah. 
There we go. Mongrel is fully evolved into his final form. Primeape. He's going to be so much more powerful. What a huge level, or a huge power spike, I should say. I'm not going to go over here. I'm just going to go straight to this cottage. Awesome, 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 dude. Yeah, it's another evolution done. We have uh, a couple more before our team is fully filled out. I mean, our team might be getting filled out here in, in the next, like, 10 episodes or, sh or so. I, I mean, I don't know why I'm saying that, because this series hasn't even hit episode 10 yet. But, um, yeah, I mean, I plan on getting a, a new team member sooner or later, like, it feels like it's been a while since a new team member has joined us, but honestly, I think that's a good thing, because, you know, we're, like, spacing out our encounters, we're, we don't want to, we don't want to, you know, throw in, like, three new members at a time, and just have them, like, all take up the spotlight, you know, I'm glad, I'm glad this is how we've been doing it, because we had Quincy, like, a couple episodes, then we had mongrel come in and dominate with quincy they're like a a nice duo and um and then beezus came in and kind of took over the show honestly i think i'm gonna teach mega punch i might as well like i don't think actually oh uh, man uh I'm not gonna learn it. I'm not gonna learn it. I kind of want to save it for a certain team member, but I, I need to use these like sometime soon, you know. Like what? What is it? like dig? No. Who? What's somebody I can teach? I mean, I could teach rest. Uh, but again, there's another team member I kind of want to save that for. What? What is this? Thunderbolt, yeah, you're definitely not. <laughs> definitely not winning a Thunderbolt, I'll tell you that much. Um, but you know what? Speaking of team members, let's go ahead and grab ourselves our fourth team member. I'm very excited for this one. Uh, I've been wanting to use this Pokemon on a Let's Play team of mine for a while. Uh, but I just honestly never got the opportunity to, even though it's one of my favorite Pokemon. It's not the Rattata, though. <laughs> I'll tell you that much. It is not the Rattata. Don't fret. I would have caught that episode one if it was. But, um... Yeah, we're just going to go ahead and look around in this grass, see if we, uh... Can uh, get him on our team right away. I mean, is this even the right route? I hope it is. I sure hope it is. It should be. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it is. It is. Don't worry, guys. I know what I'm doing. Okay, apparently we just cannot find it. So, maybe I might make a cut and uh, just see if we can find it. But, um... I'll give it two more encounters, how about that? Two more encounters, and if we don't find it, then I'll just go. Speak of the devil. Here is our new team member, Doduo. I'm so excited to use this Pokemon, man. It is honestly such an underrated Pokemon. It's fast. It has great physical attack. It is it is extremely powerful, so I'm extremely excited to bring this guy on the team and uh, just show you guys what it can do, because I mean, we need a flyer, I mean, we need one eventually, so I think this is the perfect opportunity to go ahead and grab ourselves one, and he stays in the ball, Doduo was caught, and I actually haven't thought of a name for him, so... Let's see. The Twin Bird Pokemon. Its short wings make flying difficult. Instead, this Pokemon runs at high speed on developed legs. Which is crazy, because it can indeed learn fly. 
Whew. What should we name him? Three-headed bird. Hmm. Um, I could do the easy route and just name him like Hydra or something, you know, but he's a bird. He's not like a dragon or anything. Um, oh my god. I'm, I'm going to name him Musketeer. How about that? How about that? I like that a lot. How do you spell musketeer? Let, let me look this up before I spell it wrong. Okay, okay, I got it. Okay, I got it. Just in case, I didn't want to spell it wrong. Should I name him Musketeers? I am going to name him Musketeers. There's three of them, after all. He was transferred to Bill's PC. We're going to go ahead and grab him right now. And yeah. There is our fourth team member. Super excited to have him on the squad, man. Because, dude, it's just such a dope Pokemon. Definitely probably my favorite, like, honestly, he's probably my favorite normal type. Like, I know it's more of a flying type. Where's the, where's the Pokemon Center? <laughs> Where is Pokemon Center? I have no idea where it is. Oh my god. I have no idea where it is. Please! Oh my lordy. I'm gonna be here forever. Okay, there it is. There it is. So, we're gonna go over here. Go on the PC. Deposit Pokemon. We're gonna deposit this Diglett. Cause why not? And we're gonna withdraw Musketeers, baby. Musketeers is taken out. Got Musketeers. Let's go ahead and take a look at him. Oh, he's dying. Normal flying. 50 attack. 47 speed. And he's not even evolved yet. You guys gotta realize he's not even evolved. That is some. That is a wild move set. I will say that though. That is a wild move set. That is pretty pretty bad. Um, you know what? That's okay. He just got caught on the wild. Well, let's look at. Let's compare. 61 speed, 46 attack. Okay. 69 speed, 72 attack. What about you? 46 speed, 45 attack, but 59 special and 52 defense. Uh, yeah. Musketeers, you got some catching up to do, that's for sure, but I know once you evolve, you're going to be a beast. A beast. I'll say that much. Is there anything we can teach him? Mega Punch, Bubble Beam, is that Dig? What is this? Rest? Definitely not teaching rest to him. No, I don't think there is. I really don't think there is. Let's go ahead and heal up a little bit. Yeah, we, we, we're going to need to do some training. That's for sure. Thank you. Your Pokemon are fighting fit. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. So there we go. Um, I think what we're going to do now is just explore Celadon City. I don't think there's uh, any reason to kind of overflow, you know, the, you know, what we have going on right now. So I'm going to go ahead and, you know what, let's check out the, depart the department stores here, right? Celadon Mansion. Yeah, yeah, right here. The department store now there is a quest here I believe that we can do to uh, make a, a 
couple of um, TMs come our way. Um, am, am I going to use these? Real talk, am I going to use these? No. Zero Moonstones sell for zero Poke Dollars. We can't be serious. We cannot be serious. <laughs> Why? What is up with that? You know what? Just sayonara. Sayonara. We just want to make some... Some room. We need some space. And honestly, we're going to get rid of these Pokeballs because we're actually not going to need them for the rest of the... The rest of the game. Ooh, what is this? Oh... I want to know what they are, though. I want to know what they are, though. Should I just look this up? Should I just look this up? Uh, this is so confusing. Pokemon Yellow TM Shop Department Store. I don't know. Sell it on Department Store. There we go. Floors. Let's see. Trainer market. Generation one. Right cashier. Double team. Reflect. Razor wind. Egg bomb. Mega punch. Mega kick. Takedown and submission. That is a cast of of things. That is for sure. What in the actual fooge is that? Wait, can... Hold on. Can... Can you learn Mega Kick? Can you learn Mega Kick? Let's find out. Surely he can. He has feet. Are you serious? <laughs> Why not? Why can't he learn it? I'm sleep. I'm sleep. Just go ahead and sell that then. Don't need it. Hold on. Can can he learn Mega Punch? No way. No way. That just wouldn't make any sense. Okay, thank God. I was about to say, dude. Okay, so there's there's nothing like realistically to buy here, I don't think. I think we have everything we need. I think it's a safe for yourself. A revive. I'm okay man. I'm okay man. What's this? Red and blue, both are Pokemon. Okay. Catch Pokemon are registered with an ID number and OT. They caught it. Okay. Where are you? This is just uh, nothing, I guess. I finally finished not done yet? This might be useful. TM18. I think that's counter. Just go ahead and <laughs> toss that. I don't think we, <laughs> I don't think we need counter. <laughs> I'm never going to be clicking that. I don't tell you that much. I just don't think there's a... Uh, much in the way of stuff to get here, huh? Feels like it's just kind of empty. Oh. For you. I'm thirsty. I want something to drink. Okay. Oh, a vending machine. Here's the menu. Fresh water. Fresh water popped out. Okay. Let's go and give it to her. Yep. There you go. Thank you. You can have this for me. TM13. Ice Beam? Um. Okay, what happens if I give her the other ones? What happens if I give her the other ones? 
What is that? Rock slide? Okay. Is this flamethrower? Is this flamethrower? Let's find out. What is this? Try attack. Oh my god, wait. No, he can definitely learn that. He can definitely learn that, right? Or does he have to be a, a Dodrio? He can learn it! Let's go! Try attack! That's actually a huge move to get. I wonder if I can get, like, infinite of these TMs. Hold on. Let me buy another Ice Beam. Another Soda Pop. Let's see, let's see what happens. Okay. No, uh, dude, I thought, I thought I figured it out, man. I was like, I got this. I'll keep the fresh water just in case. But like, damn, I really thought I was so smart for that. Rock slide and ice beam though, that was, that is huge. Huge, huge, huge. We will take that for sure. And uh, honestly, that's a that's a great way to kind of maybe end off the episode. Not gonna lie. You know, we did we actually did quite a bit in this episode. Surprisingly, I know it's a short one, but um, you know, I can't really think of anything else to do that would you know benefit the team right now. Besides, like, taking on the gym or... And stuff like that, but... Uh, I mean, we got a t new team member. Mongrel evolved. And, uh, we got crazy TMs from the department store. I mean... Hey. We got some upgrades on our squad. On our side. I think I am gonna do some off-screen grinding. Uh, I'm not gonna go too crazy with it, but... Uh, in the next episode, I think we're just going to go ahead and uh, take on the gym. Take on Erica and kind of show her what's up. And maybe we'll get the battle debut of Musketeers. Musketeers will have his first battle debut in the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hit the like button and subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.